All right, well, welcome to video number four of our uh, training series. Um, this is sort of a, a very general uh, tour as well as uh, cleaning. So as you walk into the Dojang, uh, the training hall, you'll sort of notice there's our pro shop. Um, we try and go through and make sure that A, we're going to dust this and keep it uh, looking kind of fresh. Um, we don't sell a lot of gear through our pro shop. Uh, it's not something that we really focus on, but we do have all the basic essentials of what we'll need as far as sparring gear, extra uniforms, um, jackets, hoodies, and the such. Some of these things we'll have in stock, so the hoodies, the jackets, we'll actually have to special order um, whenever we need those kind of things. And you'll notice the books as well. Uh, the books are part of a lending library that we have. Um, these ones here are a couple of extra ones that we can actually sell, but um, we typically just have a lending library. Um, we use Young Living products, including uh, essential oils and cleaners and stuff. So if you're coming in and maybe you're the first one in, we're going to make sure that this diffuser is running. So it's just got a cap that sits on top and another cap that sits on top of that. So that's kind of what it looks like. But we take it all apart and we want to make sure that we have water in it and it's going just below that little red knob. Um, then we pick it to pick whatever oil that you sort of that you like because you're the first one in so you get to put it in um, Once it's in I believe I've already put in lemon myrtle because I like all things citrusy um, And then we just hit this little button on the bottom Thing will turn blue and it starts to diffuse you can sort of see this the uh, It go in there. Um, so aside from that extra uniforms um, for people to purchase or if we're giving them away with our promotion of six weeks and a free uniform so they get some of that. Uh, this is extra Young Living product that people can purchase. Um, easiest person to talk to would be actually to Mrs. Rowe. Uh, just have them go talk to her directly um, but a lot of it is individually priced with the price just on the top and everything includes tax so it makes it a little bit simpler. But uh, the cleaning closet which is this door that's often closed right by the sign that says please no eating or cell phones in the dojang which people often misread no eating cell phones in the dojang um, but in here is our cleaning so there's our vacuum the long hose mop bucket uh, we get our hot water from our hot water tank right from the source and in here there's the blue and clear boxes those are the ones that have clean cloths in them uh, this is the Thieves cleaner that we use. Uh, this is the hand soap that's in the bathrooms. A couple extra bottles. Dirty cloths will go into that bag underneath the vacuum. And then uh, usually once every two weeks, we'll take that and get it cleaned and do that stuff. In order to use the vacuum, it's quite simple. Not a, light, a lot of light in here, but um, we take the end doop, and we just insert it into said port and we actually have four ports we have that one there which is kind of a universal one um, we have another one right down by the uh, curtain we have one back over on this side by this emergency exit door and there's one by the front doors as well but when we're doing uh, vacuuming you want to make sure that um, you don't sort of try and go too far because it loses some suction. So the other thing that we do a lot of is just wiping things down. And we use whoop, that cleaner. It's called Thieves Cleaner. And in this bottle, it's a 900 ml or one liter bottle, we'll end up putting one cap full of the Thieves Cleaner. So when we are ready to refill this, this one's not too bad, but we just take our Thieves Cleaner and we use the cap as our guide. We will fill that with the cleaner and then we just put it into the top and fill the rest with water and that is our our cleaner sometimes we can make it a little bit stronger but thieves is a pretty universal cleaner that we use on all surfaces whether it's the desk uh, we use it on the furniture we use it on the walls we use it on the plexiglass we use it on the mirrors on the bags basically everything that needs to get cleaned needs to get wiped down we use thieves cleaner on it including the floors. You can kind of see a bit of a shine. Uh, I did this video in the morning and I just finished mopping the floors. Um, so that's sort of why it looks a little wet. 
But you want to make sure that you're wiping things down as much as we can, including the baseboards. So anything that um, you can see where dust might collect, we want to make sure that we're keeping that area nice and clean. For our students, yes, but also for us as the instructors and staff that work here, that are in here all the time, um, we want the healthiest environment we can, which is why I went to Young Living Products, because it's the healthiest environment because they're natural products that we can, we can really get. And yeah, they're more expensive than maybe some other products, but they're natural, they're safe for us, they're safe for the kids, um, which is why we go that way. So that's sort of our cleaning um, and tidying tutorial video, I guess. Um, the other thing, just sort of to finish off, make sure that uh, we have another diffuser in the back as well. You can sort of see the light on. And this one's a little different where you don't have to put water into it, which is kind of why we have this one in the back. And this one just takes, whoa, just the full on bottles. Uh, this is just an extra bottle we have. This one is pine. I have uh, orange or citrus in there right now. <clears throat> Cause again, I like all things citrusy. Um, so just make sure that that's being shut off or turned on at the beginning of each day. All right. Thanks, guys. Thanks for everything you're doing. Um, hope you're having fun. If you have any questions or comments or concerns about anything that's sort of that you're doing or maybe not doing or just unsure about, just make sure you ask and uh, we'll keep training. Thanks, guys.